Ah, the talk box. Another one of those quintessential R&B sounds. Though, conversely, a sound very few have access to in the largely software-based era we live. So, I wanted to create a video to show you some of my favourite synth and sample-based talkbox emulations, should you want to add this sound to your productions without investing in the hardware. Of course, you cannot beat the real thing, but some of these sounds will get you close, and the sounds will get better as we go along. Links to every sound can be found down in the description below. The first sound is available for Serum and has been downloaded from Splice. A simple search of TalkBox in the preset library will bring up what's available, and as of today, this is the most viable option. Possibly this one too, but I haven't used it in a production. FS3 TalkBox Lead? I've used in many, like in the bridge of my producing for Summer Walker track. And I also used it in the producing for Masego track. Now, you can hear that it doesn't really sound like a talk box. Not really. But it gives the feeling to a degree. And that's because you can only get so far with synthesis. The real life talk box starts with a sound source, usually from a keyboard, where the player plays melodies. This then goes into the talk box with the generated sound then traveling up a tube and into the player's mouth where they can shape that sound. So the keyboard essentially acts as the voice box, so all of the melodies you are hearing come from the keyboard. But just like the real human voice, it is then shaped with a mouth to form words and articulations like we will explore in this video, oohs and ahs, that sort of thing. So we still need that human element for now. <laughs> and as producers, we also need to be able to play melodies. When I write talkbox melodies, I'm either freestyling or playing a line I first heard in my head. And it's knowing and practicing my scales that affords me both options. Scales unlock melodies, so if you do not yet know your scales and or you're not practicing your scales, you should definitely check out today's sponsor, Melodics. Melodics is an app that gives you an easy and I'd say fun way to learn and practice your scales because it's a boring exercise. I won't lie to you, <laughs> but they understand the importance too. You've got to get in your reps. Melodics connects to your keyboard, which in turn monitors your practice, how much you're doing and how well you're doing. So you'll know exactly when to move to the next exercise and onto things like arpeggios and other hand-on exercises to increase your agility, strength and independence. And they've just added some new ones too. You can try Melodics for free via the link down in the description below if you'd like to become a synth line king or queen. But not every synth line needs to be complex. And the same goes for the talk box. Sometimes I just like to layer a talk box over a bass to create that genuine pony type sound. I love the talk box as a bass, and that's because I love those low bass vocals. And this next sound is the perfect sound for this. It's from Native Instruments Duets. I did a whole video on this. I definitely suggest checking it out. But today we're focusing on one sound called Dope. I've gotten a whole lot of use out of this one. And of course, I used it in the aforementioned video. <laughs> It's a layered sound, bass and talk box, just like the previous sound, but it sounds a lot more authentic in terms of actually sounding like a talk box. And that's because one of the layers uses samples, an actual recording. So of course it's gonna have that element of realism. You may have also heard that little talk box riff. That whole line was one sample and this instrument has quite a few of those. And I've used them along with dope in other sessions too. However, for this video, we're more interested in sounds we can actually play. And for me, Dope is the best one. 
However, it does have a few other honorable mentions that also layer the samples with synths. So they sound okay, but they're not at the height of realism. That comes from the lack of different articulations. The next sound is called Humbox and it's by Bless Beats. And unless you can correct me, this is the closest you're gonna get to an authentic sound in Talkbox without having the real thing as of this recording. And this has gotten plenty of use. So Humbox is another sample based instrument that you can hear does a very good job. It has 12 different articulations, a lot more than the others, that you can switch on the fly using key switches and sound very tasteful on the turn of the mod wheel. What you just heard was me playing on the first articulation, Do, which is one of my favourites. Another one of my favourites is the No articulation. All 12 articulations have their place and sound great. But I would love to know which one is your favorite down in the comment section below as I quickly cycle through these. So there you have it guys, links to all of the sounds can be found down in the description below. Learn your scales, Melodics can help with that. And to learn about other R&B sounds you should be using, check out the video on screen right now. I've been Stefan, and as always, happy beat making.